Hi Gemini, how are you doing? I hope everything is well with you. I hope you are in high spirits and good health. Um, Gemini, this is your another reading for April 2022, but this time, let me just get myself a little lower on my chair. This time we will be doing the opportunity challenge advice spread for you. Um, so uh, it will still be a general reading that can apply to any area of your life. It will just be served to you in a little different form. Take the messages as they resonate uh, for you, apply to your situation because you know your situation best. And as always, uh, don't be afraid to interpret the messages your own way, okay? Listen to your intuition at all times. Gemini, if you enjoy the reading, if you have good time with me, I am warmly inviting you to subscribe. I'll leave a like, comment, I love interacting with you. Uh, so let me know what you think. And with that said, let's get straight into it. Your opportunity is the Ace of Cups. Does it get any better than that? A beautiful new beginning. Your challenge is the Four of Cups. That is awesome because this cup floating here is the Ace of Cups. And this person is not seeing this cup, which is your opportunity. I already like this for you. Your advice is the Six of Wands. At the bottom of the deck, you have the Temperance. Temperance is showing up uh, at least for the third or fourth time in the readings that I've done today. Uh, similarly to the tower, so healing and liberation is like a common theme across the signs. But let's get to your messages. And I have to take those two cards together because clearly they, they are inseparable. The opportunity that is showing up for you is a new opening that brings the overflow of happiness. This is all the good things, joy, happiness, pleasure, uh, creative waters. Um, the key to this is that it overflows. This is a limitless fountain of that happiness, pleasure, fulfillment, creativity, um, spiritual satisfaction and insight and growth, okay? All the good things that make you happy, primarily on emotional level, but they also soothe uh, and heal uh, your soul and make you happy on that emotional soul and spiritual level and that is showing up as an opportunity for you and also what is extremely important is ace of cups similarly to ace of coins um, is a miracle energy for me so this new beginning is coming your way like in like a miracle like a window of miraculous opportunity for you to start afresh to immerse yourself in that, that limitless fountain of healing, of pleasure, of joy, and all those good things that I, um, that I already listed earlier, okay? That is coming your way. But the challenge for you is that you don't see it. In the Four of Cups, uh, we are so focused on what we don't have or what we think we don't have, what we miss, what we want, but we think we don't have it that we don't realize, we don't notice, that we already have it or it's just around the corner. If we just looked up or look around, depending on the card, uh, it, it can be shown differently. But if we just look around and really acknowledge like mindfully our situation, we would realize that what we truly desire and what we miss and it makes us unhappy and grumpy, it's actually there. It's being handed to you. But you are not going to notice it if you keep uh, your focus on what you don't have. And as I said, being grumpy and unhappy. Okay, that's the vibe that I'm getting for you, Gemini, is that you got stuck in a little bit in that grumpiness. And you don't realize the opportunities that life is offering you. And this Ace of Cups, I said, with those pleasures and overflow, it can really be anything. It can be an offer of love. It can be a new job uh, opportunity or a creative project, it can be a financial opportunity of some kind, whatever that is, it's coming your way in a miraculous way and you don't see it. And you're going to miss it if you're grumpy like this. This person here is unhappy, they are dissatisfied, discouraged. You see how he's sitting with his hands crossed, like he's like a little kid that is unhappy because parents didn't buy him something, like mm, I'm going to be offended now, right? Don't do this to yourself because you are going to miss uh, on an opportunity big time and you don't want that. Miracles are not coming your way 
for no reason that's why and that's one and they are also not coming your way like every day okay uh this is a big time opportunity and miracle and it's really almost for some of you it may be like a once in a lifetime opportunity uh so you really want to recognize and see it sometimes four of cups can also represent a person that is bored as well okay so it's like person who's bored in the place that they're at. So they are not doing anything to make their situation better, but instead they're just like sitting there grumpy. It's like this word uh, is just stuck in my head now. And, and I'm not going to play with the other kids. I'm bored here. Okay. That's what I keep getting for some reason. Like, uh, I'm sorry. I don't want to offend you at all. I'm, I'm, I'm saying all this for your benefit. Uh, but, but it's like a spoiled child that is very hard to, um, to satisfy, that is very demanding and not recognizing, uh, all the gifts that is, is already receiving. Okay. So I hope that metaphor makes sense. Don't be that grumpy, spoiled child. Recognize the opportunities, miracles, gifts that the universe is handing you. Um, your advice is the six of wands, and that is the card of victory, success, a return uh, of a victorious king. Sometimes that's how this card is called. So your advice is to get yourself back into your victorious spirit. Okay. What you need to do is change your perspective and attitude and look at your surroundings with an attitude focused on victory, on creating happiness, satisfaction on creating triumph and success for yourself. Simple as that. Uh, that is what, what your advice is. Instead of being grumpy, bored, unhappy, dissatisfied and mindless to opportunities coming your way, change your mindset to mindset of a uh, victorious person. And that will help you recognize the opportunities and miracles that are showing up uh, in your life. With the temperance, uh, seriously, among its many meanings, this is about healing. It's, it's also like the, the divine alchemist mixing ingredients. But you know what? The meaning that I am getting for you is really like it's a divine miracle coming your way. It's truly a gift from the universe. But you are going to miss on it big time if you don't change your attitude. One of the shortest readings I've done so far, but it's like, this is the complete message for you. Smile, smile back. Stars silently smile at souls like you. Doesn't that make sense? Instead of being grumpy and happy and dissatisfied with your hands crossed, smile. The universe is smiling at you, handing you the ace of cups. Give your truth shape through clear communication. Speak up. And let's have one more for you. Adventure is out there. That is so awesome. Choosing path that is unique and creative is wonderfully courageous and inspired and requires spiritual maturity. You are doing beautifully. Continue with your journey. A beautiful word of encouragement that tells you you are on the right path or at least you have chosen or are thinking about choosing that creative unique path something that requires courage and inspiration but you need to continue on your journey by sitting like this you are missing on your opportunity and you are not moving forward okay they said one more so i'm going to give you one more Make daily time for gratitude and reflection. Maintain your sacred space and visit it daily. Absolutely. With the Four of Cups, I said this is someone who's dissatisfied. Make daily time for gratitude and reflection. Reflect on what you have and recognize uh, what is being offered to you, what opportunities you have. 
and now I'll leave it there. I hope that you enjoyed. Um, I hope it was inspired again. I didn't mean to offend you, so I hope you didn't take it that way when I said, don't be a spoiled, grumpy child. But sometimes we need to hear words like this uh, to get us back on track. So I hope it worked. Um, take care of yourself. Make the best out of it. Um, and I will see you soon. Bye.